Welcome little readers, it's Miss Jisa, and today I have another story that takes place in Uganda and is written by author Kathy Kreuter. If you haven't already watched my chat with author Kathy, um, please do so along with the other stories that she's written. I'll list them below. The story is called The Rock and Roll Rolex, and again, this story takes place in Uganda. It's written by Kathy Kreuter and Andrew Jackson Obal. Before I start the story, I want you to know that Rolex is inexpensive street food that's sold um, on the streets of Uganda. And many of you have maybe have heard the word Rolex and think of the expensive watch, but in this case, it's it's the street food that you can find in Uganda. And it's um, a chapati with scrambled eggs mixed with cabbage and tomato and onion rolled inside. So the name Rolex, some people think, came because it's they were saying rolled eggs. But when you're saying rolled eggs really loud and quick, rolled eggs, it sounds like Rolex. That's why it's called Rolex. Now, let's start the story. Rolex, egg, cabbage, onion, tomato, rolled in chapati, nice and neat, fast food, ready to eat. Ochan, the Rolex man, was at his stand early, preparing for his daily customers. Kato was driving his lorry full of rocks down the hill. He had been at work three hours already and was hungry for breakfast. Kato stopped at Ochan's Rolex stand. One of Kato's rocks wiggled and wobbled and fell off the side of the truck and hit the edge of the Rolex pan. The pan flipped up and hit Ochan's outstretched hand, sending that freshly made and wrapped Rolex up high into the sky and clean out of sight. Rat was rubbing sleep from his eyes when a paper bag landed in front of him. Rat wriggled his nose, twitched his whiskers, and sniffed a nice, fresh Rolex. What luck! But the Rolex began rolling down the hill. Rat ran after his breakfast from heaven. The Rolex that flew from Ochan, the Rolex man's hand. Cat was stretching his back when he saw Rat run by, chasing a bag. Cat grew very curious, so he began to chase after Rat, who chased the Rolex that rolled down the hill, the Rolex that flew from Ochan, the Rolex man's hand. And it rolled and rolled and rolled. Dog came around a corner and saw Cat run past, and he thought this looked fun. Dog chased Cat, Cat chased Rat, Rat chased the Rolex that rolled down the hill the Rolex that flew from Ochan the Rolex man's hand. The little boy woke up wondering where his dog had gone and saw the tail flash past. So the boy ran after the dog. The dog chased cat. Cat chased rat. Rat chased the Rolex as it rolled down the hill. The Rolex that flew from Ochan the Rolex man's hand. And it rolled and rolled and rolled. Stop! The mother stopped sweeping and yelled at the boy. Then the mother chased the boy. The boy chased the dog. Dog chased cat. And cat chased rat. Rat chased the Rolex as it rolled down the hill. The Rolex that flew from Ochan, the Rolex man's hand. And it rolled and rolled and rolled. The Rolex that flew from Ochan, the Rolex man's hand, rolled and rolled. And at the bottom of the hill, the Rolex came to the same rock and rolled up the rock, flipping through the air. And Ocha and the Rolex man caught it. Well, there you are. Kato is gone, but thanks for bringing customers. They all went home tired and confused. Why on earth had they been running? And as for Rat, he was still hungry. Think before you follow. The one in front may not know where they are going either. 
And in the back is a Rolex recipe if you'd like to try to make this food and a little bit about Rolex. Thank you for joining us today. Join me next time for another story. Thank you for joining me today. Remember to like and subscribe to support our channel.